volume of a rectangular prism using the area of the base. You've learned how to calculate the volume of a rectangular prism using the formula volume equals length times width times height. In this lesson, however, we will learn how to find the volume of a rectangular prism when the area of the base is already provided. Let's look at this rectangular prism. In this rectangular prism, the area of the base is given. Remember, the area of a rectangle is calculated by multiplying the length by the width. So, the base B of this figure is equal to the product of the length and width, which we write as B equals L times W. This means we can remove the L times W part in the formula V equals L times W times H and replace it with B. This gives us V equals B times H. This formula is useful when we want to find the volume of a rectangular prism whose base area is known. Let's now calculate the volume of our rectangular prism using this formula. The area of the base is 12 inches squared, so we substitute 12 for B. And we replace the height, H, with 4. Now our formula reads as V equals 12 times 4. The product of 12 and 4 equals 48. So the volume is 48. But we can't forget to write the units. Height and base area use inches. Since volume describes three-dimensional space, the units are inches cubed or cubic inches. So the volume of this rectangular prism is 48 inches cubed. In this lesson, you learned how to find the volume of a rectangular prism using the formula volume equals area of the base times height.